Now that we have our first table, we can start creating other tables in order to create relationships. For now, we have our clients table. Let's add a new table for a company where we can assign what company this client works with. So let's call this table companies and assign an icon. Let's now add a text field for the company's name and save. Now we have a new table for our companies and we can now create a new record for the company. So let's call this company one and company two. Okay, now we have two tables and we want to link these tables together. In order to do this, let's go to the clients table and click on link to and select the company's table. Now we have created a relationship between the clients and the company's table. Now let's save changes. And here we can also change the name of this field. So let's put it as company and adjust it to our form. Now we can assign what is the company that we wish to link. So let's click on the field and choose the company that we want. So let's assign client one to company one, client two also to company one, and client three to company two. Now that we've created this relationship between these two tables, we can see that the client is linked to a company in a one-to-many relationship. So one company can contain many clients, but each client can be linked only to one company. So this will make a one-to-many relationship. If we go back to the clients table, we can also assign the company information in our table view by clicking on the title row, selecting show column, select company, and choose the field that you wish to display. So let's choose the company's name. And let's now change the title for this field. Let's call this company. In the same way, if we go to the companies table, we can also select in our table view the information that we wish to display about our clients. So now let's click on the title row and show column. Select clients, ID, and let's count how many clients each company contains. So again, let's change the name of this column, number of clients, and we can see that the count is correct. Company one has two clients and company two has one client. Also, if we now go to the data model view, we can see that the table finds is linked to companies in a one-to-many relationship. Ninox.